Hey everybody, welcome back. All right, continuous mind sense is on. Let's grab this two-handed sword over here. See what kind of condition it's in. Mediocre, and it's in worn condition, but uh, we may indeed find a use for it. Uh, as a matter of fact, how much pierce or thrust damage too? That's not bad. Look out, Baron. There you go. Alright, we have learned uh, Riposte. Now we're going to work on maneuvering in armor 1. I can already feel that encumbrance slowing us down here. All right, I'm just going to go in here. I was hoping to get Baron on one side of them and me on the other. That didn't quite work. Oh. There we go. Uh, I don't want to look at the quarterstaff. Uh, these... Are not bad. I'll throw those spalters on here. And we already have boots, so we're good on this stuff. Okay. Uh, so here's a male shirt. Um, I really don't want any more encumbrance right now, so I'll get one later. I'm going to give this to Baron. Uh, these van braces are nice, but they go with a very specific set of gauntlets that we don't have. And here's a vest, whatever. <laughs> whatever. I'll just take the extra encumbrance. And then this axe right here, well made. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm going to take that, toss this. In fact, let me go ahead and upgrade this here. So now it's in good condition. And, uh, yeah, not bad. Not bad. All right, we don't need that key. That was for the cell where the two-handed sword was. Okay. So the nice thing, of course, about this axe is that you can flip it around to do piercing damage. So if we run up against heavily armored enemies, we just flip it to pierce. Otherwise, we use the, the slashing edge, of course. Nice and versatile. Didn't think I'd get to him. That's good. Uh, nothing special there. Let's move on. That was my fault for rushing into the fight when I knew I wouldn't be able to see because of the stupid archway. I knew better, but I was impatient. Let that be a lesson. Don't fight under archways. Don't do it. What? I got caught on the wall there. And I don't... I, again, I don't know if that was Baron, but I'm assuming that was Baron that hit me. I was not looking at Baron. Uh, but if that was, that makes it, uh, what, two? Two to nothing in favor of Baron with the friendly fire? Absolutely shocked, man. That spiked club is nothing to write home about. 
Once again, only half a circle of crush damage. Not good enough. We've got our XP for reading that stuff. There we are. Yeah, I really like this axe. Okay, so here's a full salve, which is great if I could just get close enough to actually pick it up. There we go. Alright. Another upgrade sphere. They used, these guys used to always kind of rush up right here, but now they tend to just sit in this room. Now we're getting some attention, though. That's exactly how that's supposed to go. But looks like the other guys will not be rushing over here, so we're just going to move through. Try to get them to move through the chairs so that they fall over. Get out of the way so Baron doesn't hit me. Oh, that's wonderful. There's one reason that that happened. There is one reason that I went in that direction, and that was to avoid getting hit by Baron, and instead I got absolutely destroyed. Ah, oh, good God. I just... I hate Baron so much. I, I can't... I can't articulate it. I can't put it into words. I hate Baron with a passion. Alright, we are now at half our health. Absolutely splendid. Wonderful. That's right, even if Baron doesn't hit me, I still blame him. You got that right. Alright. Curious. I want that because my uh, encumbrance is just ridiculous right now, so instead we're going to slow Baron down. That'll be the plan there. Alright, nothing special. We have to retrace our steps here a little bit. Time to face plant up here. Oh, we made it. Did not face plant. Unbelievable. Will wonders never cease? There we go. This dude locked himself in the bathroom. That'll work. Attempt number three. All right. Uh, don't need any of those things or those.
Oops. Nice little one two combo. Actually, don't mind the fact that Baron has not caught up with me. Can make things easier. Okay. Nothing better than what we currently have here. All right, we've learned trust. We're now going to work on loyalty. And, you know, these are decent. I'll go ahead and give these to Baron. They have better coverage and either the same stats or better than what he was previously wearing. Okay. Ah, here we go. A better Gambeson for me at last. Baron already has one that's even better than this one I just picked up. It's a good thing he was dead, because obviously I fell over. That Great Axe is halfway decent as a secondary weapon, but I'm going to pass on it for now. Okay. Um, nope, we're good on all that stuff. sure we read this stuff. Read in quotation marks. Make sure we get that XP. Check this box even though we know there's nothing useful in it. Same reason. Alright, and now the absolutely ridiculous room. Let's try to just pull one or two at a time here. Oh, I'm not going to talk to you about the lamps right now, Baron. I kind of have other things going on. I don't know if you noticed. Very nice. Alright, let's just check this stuff quickly. Uh, there we go, there's a decent helmet. Yup, give that to Baron. Uh, carpentry knife, hatchet. Yeah, you don't need any of those weapons. Uh oh, I think I aggroed all five of them. Oh well, it's bound to happen. Nice job, Baron.
Oh, well, this is great. Alright, well, we took even more red health damage, so we're now at an absolutely ridiculous level of red damage. But, uh, you know, what are you going to do? I mean, we could use a salve, obviously, but, uh, no, not yet. Actually, you know what? Might as well. It, it really makes absolutely no difference. I'm going to use that half salve. All right, now it goes from bad to worse when we fight something like five skeletons, two of them with shields. All right, let's try to lay this here. There we go. Try to get them to come over here. down. Well, they are all aggroed on Baron for some reason. I mean, it's bully for me, but uh, not good in the long run. Had to stop that swing. Oh my goodness. That went much better than I thought it would. Alright, there's some really good boots. And we'll swap out his male shirt and give him a better shield. Over here, let me compare. Those are slightly better than the ones I'm wearing, so we'll take those. And the male gauntlets as well. Definitely want a coif. Those are better. And I'll take this male shirt. And I th think that's good for now. Alright, so we're going to take the C in the Dark helmet right here. Throw that on. Now we can switch to our secondary, which will be the two-handed sword. Uh, there's actually a nice great axe there, too. Let's give this to Baron as its secondary. Yeah, and it's uh, mini-boss time. We're going to try to thrust here. There we are. Got two. Missed on that one. And that one. There's a good one. Oops, walked right into it like an idiot. He accidentally hit me. There we go. Alright, we actually don't want any of this stuff. I'm pretty sure Baron has got to be pretty hurt. Yeah, not good, but I can keep going. Well, guess what, Baron? I'm not giving you a health salve. I've done it before, and what did I get for it? Nothing. Now, this two-handed mace is obviously lovely. Uh, we'll stick with the sword for now, though. Uh, some bill hooks. Mallet. There's some, whoops, some wonderful plate gauntlets, which I will take, give Baron the male gauntlets, and I don't care about these axes, and an upgrade sphere. All right, and that means we can move on to the second floor. So this is where we're going to end this episode. Thank you, as always, for hanging out, everybody. I appreciate it. Please hit like and subscribe if you would like to, and I will see you all next time.